Alright, so I heard this from Clickhole, that apparently you're grounded. Now, do you know why you're grounded? That is the question. How about we find out? Hey, look at mum, I know you're upset, but I need to make sure you understand why what you did was wrong, okay? Do you know why your mum had to crown you today? Okay. You can sit there and pout all you want, but it won't make you less grounded. So let me ask you again. Do you know why you're grounded? This one is interesting. It's not like the others. Ethan Michael... If you don't talk to me, I have no problem adding another week to your punishment. And I don't think you want that, so let me ask you one more time. Do you know why you're grounded? If anyone out there is called Ethan, I do not know what you did. But anyway... Uh, you probably misbehaved. Well, yes, but can you tell me specifically what you did that was wrong? I was mean to Grandpa. I hurt Grandpa's feelings. This one? How so? Dots? Don't pretend like you don't know you ripped off gra Grandma's. Um... <laughs> Didn't you? <laughs> uh, how did you do that? Say it loud for mum. Say I ripped grandma's arm off. I'm just gonna mumble it. <laughs> Oh, great. That's right, you ripped Grandma's arm off. And then what did you do? <laughs> I'm just gonna pick this one. You blew your nose, sweetie. You took Grandma's arm and spanked her with it, didn't you? You spanked her while yelling, stop. Spanking yourself. Stop spanking yourself. And then you climbs up gr Grandma's chair, pulling down her pants and tooted. Oh, pulling down your pants and tooting in her face. Causing Grandma to throw up all over her nice new blouse. Do you think Grandma liked it? <laughs> Uh, and do you think Grandma liked it when you ran out of the cul-de-sac and screamed, I snatched some nasty old orangutan's paw so loud that the neighbor's kids came outside to see what the commotion was? And then you and the neighbor's kids took turn holstering grandma's arm above your heads like the Stanley Cup belting we are the champions at the top of your lungs. Do you think grandma liked that? <laughs> oh... What did he do, Ethan? That made Grandma very, very sad. She threw up again when she saw you do that. And do you know what else made Grandma sad? Dots? Ethan, don't act like you don't know. When I cooked her arm in the microphone so long that it popped, the microwave, 
I reckon this one's meant to say microwave. So this one. Yep, when you cooked her arm in the microwave so long that it popped. It hurt grandma's heart to see you, you do that, especially because you were wearing the little chef outfit she made you for Halloween. She worked very hard to make that for you. Oh. So tell the truth, sweetie. It wasn't even what you did to Grandma or her arm that made Mummy so mad. Everyone makes mistakes. <laughs> what really made Mummy sad was the fact you lied to me and told me that Grandma ripped off her own arm because she wanted to mail it to Grandma, Grandpa in hell so he would have something to hold hands with. You lied to me because you thought it would get you out of trouble, but instead it did the opposite. It got you into even more trouble. And now you can't play the Nintendo Switch for a whole week. Bites back tears. <laughs> oh, great. Come here, sweetie. Give mum a hug. Even though mum's mad at you, I still love you very, very much. Okay. But it's important that you tell mummy the truth from now on. Okay. And promise me that you'll try to be better about not dismembering Grandma in the future. <laughs> That's my big boy. Love you. Sure, love you too. Get results. You understand why you're grounded, but you're still upset about it. You realize now that it was mean to rip you your grandma's arm off, but it stinks that you have to be grounded for a week. Your grandma barely even uses her arm anymore. She mostly just sits there. You wish you weren't grounded so that you could play your Nintendo Switch and your favorite Nintendo Switch game is Xenoblade Chronicles 2. It is fun. You wish your mum would have spanked you instead of taking your Nintendo Switch away. Alright, so I could probably run through it again, but... Yeah, I reckon that's enough for now. But anyway, this is Channel 450. My name's Oat. That's so we're getting signing out. Ethan, what did you do?